Hi, Coach Fraser here today to talk to you about a topic that actually is probably one of our, our number one challenges or questions that we face as coaches. And that is, how do I take more time out of my practice because I'm a slave to it? Um, you know, I'm resentful because I'm working so hard. I don't have time for my family. Um, I feel like I'm controlled by my practice and I'm living someone else's dream or life. Okay, and let's switch that thinking. We're gonna go through the process that, that allows you to start to take control and design the practice that supports you, your ideal life, your dream life, that gives you, uh, rather than just being busy, being productive, okay? And, and literally giving you back control in your practice. Let's talk about this today. There's five questions that you need to ask yourself that can help you design the ideal number of hours in your practice. And, and, and they are number one, okay? Number one, it's, it's how many visits are you currently seeing? So in our example, let's take 100, okay? Question number two, how many visits do you want to see? And for our example, we'll, do, we'll say 150. Now I'm gonna stop there for a moment because at Full Circle Coaching, we have all sorts of time management and efficiency uh, tools to help us derive some of these numbers. Where do they come from? And how do we manage our time more effectively? But you know, as part of this process, this is one of the layers that we can go through. So question number three, how long does it take to give a loving, authentic adjustment to each and every practice member. Our metric is really simple. How long does it take you to adjust your family? How long does it take you to deliver a, 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 a loving, authentic adjustment to your child? So, because that should be the standard that you apply to your practice. So let's, for our sake of argument, let's say that's five minutes, okay? Now, what we do, we do the math. Question four, do the math. And if we take the 150 visits and we divide that by, by the, the five, we end up with 12, well, we know that it's 12 per hour, okay? And that means that it equates out to only 12 and a half adjustment hours per week. So let number, question number five, how many more hours do you need to add to that in order to accomplish all of the other things you need to do in practice. So let's, let's, let's add a couple of hours for marketing and management and a few hours for exams and new patients, okay? So if we, do, if we give 10 more hours to our practice time, we literally come up with 22 and a half hours per week. That's the only, so in this case, that's all the hours you need to work in order to deliver your version of an authentic loving adjustment to, to meet the goal that you set for yourself of 150 visits per week. So how many, how many hours are you working? And is it truly authentically representing your value system in terms of what you wanna create for your ideal life? So our client, Rena, used this exact tool and exercise to drop from 27 hours a week in practice to 20 hours a week in practice. And she also did it by maintaining the exact same amount of revenue, which gave her more time for her family, her date nights, and freedom to do the things that she loved to do with her life. So ask yourself, are you struggling with these kinds of questions? Are you, are you not sure you're a slave to your practice and you wanna design that life around your practice as opposed to your practice demanding and controlling your agenda and your life? Reach out, talk to us. We can help you create that authentic lifestyle, that authentic practice. Click the link below and, and, and literally talk to one of our coaches and let's see if we have potentially a solution to help you figure out that ideal practice so that you can regain your time, your values, and your life. Thanks for listening.